Hassan Hakmoon is a Moroccan musician who specializes in the Ganawa style. Hakmoon was born to a family of musicians who introduced him to the musical world of the Ganawa. By age four, he performed alongside great masters of the Ganawa all over Morocco and in Casablanca for Lila. His mother is known throughout the city as a mystic healer. At the age of 14 he became master of Ganawa music. Hakmoon began learning Ganawa music from his mother, a mystic healer in Marrakesh who organizes Dear Diba trance ceremonies, which are often all-night affairs involving hypnotic playing and chanting to exorcise spirits. Hakmoon witnessed his first trance ceremony at the young age of four. He proceeded to study Ganawa music after a musical ceremony that healed his sister Mina Hakmoon. He eventually chose the sinter as his main instrument, a three-string lute with a body made of camel skin stretched over nutwood. The strings of the sinter are pitched low, enabling the instrument to serve as the bass foundation much like the western string bass, while its tone is sweet, making it well suited to carry the melodic line of a composition. By drumming on the body of the instrument, Hakmoon added his own percussion while contributing vocals, thereby creating a unique foundation for his musical explorations and growth. By the age of 14, he was an established musician performing at Ganawa Lila ceremonies with his own ensemble. Today, Hakmoon is known as the godfather of Ganawa music. Hakmoon made his U.S. debut in 1987 at Lincoln Center in New York City with Ishan and Blanca Lee's trio Nya and the Nomadist Dance Group. He subsequently relocated to New York where he was received by artists such as composer and producer Richard Horowitz and Peter Gabriel. He became a fixture in New York's rock, jazz and fusion scenes, spanning multiple genres. In 1989 Hakmoon became part of the group Magmwat Hakmoon with his brother Said and relatives Muhammad Bashar and Abdul Haq Damad. Later that year, with help from Robert Browning and the World Music Institute, Hakmoon produced and released his debut album Fire Within, with Adam Rudolph and jazz trumpeter Don Cherry. Together they made a Ganawa jazz fusion recording, Gift of the Ganawa. Hakmoon began to expand his musical range, adding American sounds to the Moroccan form. This led him to form the group Sahar, meaning luck, whose music fused elements of rock and jazz with African styles. With the ensemble, Hakmoon recorded his first album featuring electric instruments and continued to perform around New York City. One such instance occurred during a performance at the Knitting Factory, whose audience members included Miles Davis and Daniel Lanois, who proceeded to introduce Hakmoon to an important future collaborator pop musician Peter Gabriel. In 1992 Hakmoon joined Gabriel's Woman, founded in 1980. Hakmoon released another album, Trance, at Gabriel's Real World Studios in Bath, England. From Bath, Hakmoon toured Europe, the Middle East and the US along with other Womad artists, including performing under the group's auspices at the Woodstock 94 Festival in 1994. His albums Fire Within, Gift of the Ganawa and Trance topped the charts for World Music Albums, World Music Charts Europe, New World and CMJ's Radio Top 150 and were selected by Rolling Stone as one of the hot picks of 94. His powerful performances and sounds also resulted in letters of admiration from former New York City Mayor David Dinkins, television host Jay Leno and saxophonist David Sanborn, as well as from executives at the New York Times and the British Broadcasting Corporation. In 2002 Hakmoon teamed up with American-born producer Fabian Alsutani to record a new album, The Gift. The album included the release of the single, This Gift, a duet with Grammy-winning singer-songwriter Paula Cole. In 2003 The Gift received an Indie Award for Best Contemporary World Music Recording from the Association for Independent Music. In addition to producing his own albums, Hakmoon has contributed to other artists' recordings, adding to such projects as Caravan for D.D. Bridgewater's album Prelude to a Kiss, Ozo Motley Street Sings, which won the award for Best Alternative. Music album at the Latin Grammy Awards in 2005 and Love Light for Paula Cole's Courage in 2007. Hawkmoon has also composed and recorded for several films such as Rendezvous in Samarkand directed by Tim Bridwell, The Past and the Present of Gemma Al Fina by Steve Montgomery and the documentary Footsteps in Africa. Hawkmoon appeared in several movies as an actor, dancer and musician, including Disney's Jungle 2 Jungle in 1997 and Rollerball by John McTiernan in 2002. Today Hakmoon continues to record and perform in major festivals and venues around the globe, as well as give master workshops in universities. Hakmoon subsequently began a project in collaboration with other percussive dancers to create a new style of Ganawa dance. Hakmoon was married to Lynn Francisco in 1987. They had a son named Jamel, born 1988 August 9th. 
In June 2002, Hawk Moon married fellow musician Paula Cole. They had a daughter named Sky Cole Hawk Moon, born in 2001. Hawk Moon met Cole on the Peter Gabriel Secret World Live Tour in 1994. The couple divorced in 2007. Hawk Moon married Shikako Iwahori in Tokyo in 2012. Thanks for watching.